From a distance, an uneasy calm appeared to have settled over the Golden Temple, but close up, the effects of the 10 day siege between Sikh extremists and soldiers were apparent. After the surrender of 46 militants on Wednesday, Indian troops again controlled the temple, the Sikh faith's holiest shrine. Their first task was the removal of bodies from the temple complex. Two corpses had to be retrieved from the sacred lake, which must now be drained and refilled. The death toll during the siege was 45, mostly militants. The violence across the Punjab state since the surrender has claimed dozens of lives. The Indian government hopes to reopen the Golden Temple for worship, but the damage inflicted both inside and out during the siege was extensive. Normally spotless offices inside the temple grounds were littered with rubbish and rubble, and the cleanup job is expected to take weeks. The militants were well armed for an extended occupation of the Holy Sanctum. After the siege, police displayed the large cache of weapons found inside, which included anti-tank rockets and more than 3,000 rounds of ammunition. 
Seekelders say they'll cooperate with police to prevent future attempts to turn the Golden Temple into an armed fortress. <laughs> 